just pray with every fiber in my being that my father returns to us. The anxious prayers, please really, of Frank Aguilar's family and friends rang out across this Montebello neighborhood tonight. In his mom's front yard, they hosted a vigil, leaning into their faith as they searched for answers to where he is and why they can't reach him. I don't know if I can take it. He's my first child. A 20-year veteran of the Los Angeles Fire Department, Aguilar has not been heard from since Friday, which his family says is entirely unlike him. As he regularly does, he went to his home in Rosarito, Mexico last week and had been staying in touch until suddenly all communication stopped. His brother and cousin went to Rosarito this past weekend, and what they found is worrisome. Tables were overturned. It was a crazy, crazy episode. Vehicles are missing, items were missing. It was devastating to hear on this side of the country. Like, it was so heartbreaking to hear from his daughters and his family. His daughters say generations of the family have lived in Rosarito, a place they say they know well and call home, which is adding to their shock. As police and the FBI investigate, his loved ones are desperate for answers, but understandably terrified of what those might be. His oldest daughter not wanting to think the last time she spoke to her dad will be the last time ever. Like we were on FaceTime the other day and he was on the beach and just talking to me about how much, so much fun and how this is a little taste of what retirement would be like for him. His daughters posted this Instagram video today asking the governor to get involved to help find their dad who was given 20 years of his life serving the community. In Montebello, I'm Lori Perez, KCAL 9 News.